Hi everyone, it's Tom from Health and Body Tone. Today I'm going to show you how to make my favorite protein bars. I've been making this for a while now. Here's the secret ingredients. I have oats, protein powder, different variety of seeds. Here I'm using sesame, pumpkin seeds. I have uh, cinnamon, a couple of nuts, any will do. Shredded coconut. Cocoa powder, milk powder, and ground alisay for an extra bit of protein. Okay, so here, as you can see, I've put in the, uh, the nuts, the cup full, straight into the bowl. Oats. We'll be putting in uh, just over two cups. That's one. Just takes a little bit of time. All right, that's two. And I like to just, just about a third or a quarter. Two and a bit. All right, then the protein powder don't need the cup one two as you can see I'm using vanilla next and again these are all the dry ingredients I'll show you the wet ingredients once this is complete with the milk powder, we're going for one and a half cup. That's the other half. Okay, that's done. Next, I will use a big paste spoon. Um, with the cocoa powder and go about a half, a big half. That'll do, just gives it more texture. Um, okay, so with the shredded coconut, a decent two tablespoons. The seeds. I'll have a cup full of just a variety of different seeds. And the third one. And here's my cup. And the last for the dry stuff is my cinnamon and again no more than half that's plenty you don't want it to overpower taste and then just mix it all up so that's all the dry stuff okay here's the wet stuff dried fruit is uh, get straight in. One and a half bananas, two eggs, maple syrup. This one's actually sugar free. I prefer that one, obviously, no sugar. I find you can only get this one in Coles though. And about a quarter of a cup of water or a juice. So the water's in, the dry fruit is in. With the eggs, it's only the egg white. All right, so it's not the whole egg, just the two egg whites. Here we go, nice and easy. 
one and a half bananas. Beautiful. You can literally get out and get these get these ingredients down to your local supermarket and have the best homemade bars money can buy. And with the maple syrup, just over half. Perfect. Easy. So now what you gotta do with this, mix it up. Mix it up nicely, just with your clean hands. That's pretty much done. Takes about a minute. And once you've done that, we've mixed this one before. I mean, and mix it all up. As you can see, it's pretty easy, it mixes pretty well. Good balance, wet and dry. You can get creative with this mix as well. As long as you stay within the, uh, the portions, so you don't want to put more protein powder in. If you're going to do that, something else has got to come out, like maybe reduce some of the oats. But I find with with what I've given you, it's a it's pretty much perfect balance. That's pretty much all mixed now. Lovely. So here's the mix. Nice and full. Pretty straightforward. So in each bar you're getting around 20 grams of carbs and about 6 grams of protein all up around between 120 and 180 calories per bar strain the oven warm it up first and that's uh, 160 degrees celsius for around 15 minutes, I find it works best. 15, 16, no more than that. 15 minutes now. Let's see. Let's see what they look like. That's what they look like after 15 minutes. Okay, so I hope you enjoyed my recipe and enjoy them for many years to come. Have a go and um, let me know how you went.